Alright, uh, I'm feeling a little down again, so might as well, you know, just get more depressed by losing in the arena. So yeah, currently I am studying, and I guess that's part of my de the cause of my depression, but mainly it's just, you know, uh... Just some pers personal issues. No need. No need to, uh, I guess, reflect on them. No need to reflect on uh, those kind of issues. So let's toss the Lord of the Arena out, and we got a Tiger instead. Not particularly ideal, but it will have to do. Uh, so we're versing a shaman again. We've done really well against uh, shamans, so <clears throat> hopefully this guy doesn't have big removal. I would be pretty bummed if this guy had a lightning bolt at turn one. I'm pretty sure that's a one coster ability as well. Thing is, if he can, if he plays it now, he can actually uh, play a totem or any two costers next turn. So the map's on Ogrimmar. There's the lightning bolt. I mean, it was pretty much expected, I guess. I hope you like my invention. Hellfire. All right. I don't have really any major plays. He took out my Flame Imp, which I was actually intending to buff him up to a 5-4. Another Demon Fire. Let's see. Shadow Bolt. I'm not sure if I want to Mortal Coil that Steering Totem. Oh, if you're sure. I'll just keep bashing on him for now. So he's at four mana. Maybe he'll play something big. I wonder. I also wonder. I didn't hit anything. Imp Master. I mean, that's that's fine. That's a demon. That uh, I guess I could do a couple of things, but for now, I think I would probably go. Hmm. I might go Mortal Coil into a Shadow Bolt. So there's a Shadow Bolt. Coil. Corruption. And I'll just hit this thing. I mean, I was considering doing it in previous turn. But seeing as he didn't play a Totem, I guess it, it was fine. It's a Totem, maybe it's a... S oh, it's a healing one. Ouch. That's kind of annoying. Because the healing totem is absolutely perfect with the Acolyte of Pain. So, I'll play Tez Dingo right here. Dingo. <clears throat> I guess there's no point attacking these oh, normal ones, so... Sure. I'll just keep on going and attacking that. Hopefully he doesn't play a charge or a taunt. A taunt would be very bad. He's at six mana, so his possibilities are, I guess, seemingly endless, depending on his hand. I mean, he's got six cards in his hand, so he should have possibilities. Unlike last time, where he just went instantly to the totem. So, who knows what it will be. 
We didn't draw Alex Straza in the second and third game. I'm not I'm not happy about that. But then again, uh those games were one game, so yeah. Actually no, did I did I draw Alex Straza at second game? I think I did. Hmm. Or at least I don't remember anymore. Far sight. That could be an extremely good card, or it could be an extremely useless card. The flesh eating ghoul. Ah. Reason to hellfire then. Yeah, I would assume that. Yeah, Hellfire might actually be the optimum choice here. So let's see, should I buff up? No, I shouldn't buff up it before this uh, Hellfire. So I will not forget to attack. Oh, if you're sure. I will Hellfire. He draws one card, but that is fine. I will go ahead and buff the testing go up. Lens the sun well. Four three. So I guess he's relatively a weaker version of B -b 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 Booty Bay. What is a four three taunt? I'm not sure if there is any. Actually, oh, I don't know. My mind's going blank on me right now. Either way, I have two, I have two buffs or forms of removal as well. I have a way to get my Void Walkers and Doom Guard or Blood Imps, maybe. I mean, never drew Blood Imps with the, with this spell. Could Siphon Soul any of his big guys? If he has a War Golem like the last two games, then I can obviously Soul Siphon that. I can Tiger and I can life tap at the same time. This shaman's up. Uh oh. Arcane Golem, not particularly good, but uh I guess it's alright. Alright for this instance, because he's close to 10 mana. So I will. Since demons, I'll trade over here. Since demons trade, I already used the coin, so. I could tiger. I might tiger. Push forward. So I'll tiger and life tap. Drain life. Well, I couldn't have done anything with that anyway. So next turn I will possibly play Sense Demons and play whatever comes out of there. It's probably going to be a Doom Guard, which I would probably not play. But if the other is a Void Walker, then I'll definitely play it because Shield Master will probably go down. What to do? Jungle Panther, 3 mana, I'm not sure if that's reasonable or not, I mean it's prone to getting hit by either just multi-target uh, spells instead of single target spells like Drain Life or something. Uh, I don't know what you should do. Huh, no no screaming or anything like that. I wonder. Yeah, th there's no murlocs or or wa wolves or anything. I wonder what happened. Little time. I'm hitting nothing. Wow. Your magic spellbreaker. I mean. Is he gonna totem? him? 
Well, I don't know about that. So how many cards do I have? I have eight cards. I'll have nine cards when I sense demons. I could possibly have three one costers, so I don't know, let's try it. Wordwalker and Doomguard. Okay, so no one costers, but uh I can play this. I can play these two. And I'll do that. Why do you fall? The light protects me. Should I just rush him down? No, I shouldn't. I shouldn't risk anything like that. Boom. So, I basically won. I've got this Doom Guard. I forget about the two random cards. I basically won this. I could always say I could always drain life as well. So, unless he has a lightning storm, I'm pretty much in the clear here. Or if he has a uh, the big elemental, the the taunt one. Earth elemental was it called? It's one of those. Either way, this looks like one victory to me anyway. Lightning Storm. So he, unfortunately, he cannot get my Void Walker. Yeah, he needs to draw a Taunt right now. And he needs to take care of my Void Walker as well. He got himself a Taunt. Which was lucky. He needs to reveal that panther. I mean, that panther's been in stealth forever, which is not something you should be doing. Well, it looks like I'm gonna uh, beat him. If he has fork lightning, then that would be a good card. Ah. Ah, yes. So that would prove some difficulties, because I cannot, actually I can beat him. Uh huh. So first off, let me do this first. Who dares summon me? It was a risk. So yeah, the risk there was that the Doom God would have taken out the second uh, Demon Fire, and I wouldn't have been able to, how should I say it, beat him at that turn. He would have been one health. So hold on, let me take a quick look at my Skype. Yeah, I'll do that.